All right, greetings everybody. In this video, I'm going to attempt to try to explain and to demonstrate how I set up my action. So there's three things that we need to talk about first. First thing is that we have a straight neck and that all of the frets have been leveled. Number two, we have a back angle incorporated into our heel. And then thirdly, that we have about a quarter of an inch um, height difference from the fretboard to the top of the cigar box guitar itself. All three of those things need to be in place first, and then we will set up our action. All right, so here's a trick that I, I use. Once you do this a few times though, you won't need to do this trick. You'll be able to just eyeball it. So I get one of these long metal rulers you can get any kind of a long ruler or a long stake that you like, as long as you trust it. And then you're going to set one side on the zero fret or the nut, and then the other side on your quarter. And then you're just going to measure how high, and then mark it on your bridge piece there. All right, so here's an up close view. I'm setting on the quarter. And then, of course, down there is the, I'm sitting on the nut, the zero fret. And then all I do is measure where to cut that saddle piece. And if you want a little bit of higher action, you just raise this up a little bit. And again, you just eyeball it. Where do you want your action? Again, the fret or whatever it is that you're going to put on here is going to add just a little bit more so figure your strings are probably going to ride right about right about there all right so i'm still sitting on the nut here's the action here where and i went ahead and cut this now keep in mind i'm going to have a fret or something on here so it's going to be just a little bit higher the height of the fret and so i'm going to have my ultimate action here it's going to be just about right all right, it looks like we're coming in right at about 11 sixteenths on this one. And here's the string height on the fretboard. All right, to wrap it up, you can see the action here. Now, I have a tendency to go just a little bit higher. And if it's too high, then I'll just take this thing out and then sand the bottom of it and then kind of work with it, get it in place. If it's too low, <clears throat> sometimes what I'll do is I'll get like a business card and cut out a little footprint for it and raise it up. So there's many different tricks that you can do after the fact, uh, but this is a way to get kind of in the ballpark to begin with. So, 